Hello everyone and welcome back to the Bond Armory. I'm Ray Crumpled and today we're going to be taking a look at another piece of James Bond's tactical gear from No Time to Die. This time around, the Carbon Tactics Epoch Buckle. And we're probably going to spend an uncomfortable amount of time with my crotch on camera. When the No Time to Die poster was finally revealed with Bond in his commando outfit, the entire Bond community went crazy trying to identify the sweater, the undershirt, pants, boots, gloves, and of course, the holster. Now there was a little bit of awkwardness that was pointed out by both Bond fans and firearms enthusiasts alike. Bond is holding his PPK, but using an oversized thigh holster. My immediate thought was that the PPK was his backup weapon and there was some other firearm in that holster. For whatever reason, they left the holster empty in the promo shots. Now, that was the original poster. Since they pushed the date back, they've changed it. Bond is now holding a SIG 226, which makes much more sense to be in that holster. But of course, it looks a little awkward not having Bond with his PPK on a poster. Anyway, I wanted to know what the actual holster itself was. I spent days going through Google, Amazon, eBay, forums, just trying to see if anybody knew what the identification was for the holster. Uh, one day on Instagram, I received a message update um, that Carbon Tactics, a company that makes uh, really cool belts and some other gear, um, claimed responsibility for the buckles that are on the holster, which does lend some credibility to what uh, I've heard on some of the forums, that the entire holster itself is just pieced together through different uh, parts and things. I got in contact with uh, Carbon Tactics, and they told me, yes, it was in fact their Epoch buckle that you see on Bond's holster. So of course I got really excited. Um, I ended up ordering the black on black Epoch single layer, and I absolutely love this thing. Uh, it's really cool. There's a lot of cool features, so let's go into the specs. The Carbon Tactics Epoch is available in three different styles. Single layer, double layer, and biothane hybrid double layer. The belt itself is available in three different colors. Black, wolf gray, and coyote brown. Once you've chosen the belt color, they have three different options for the buckle as well. Black, silver, and dark earth. The Carbon Tactics Epoch is made from CNC machined aluminum. It features a quick release mechanism that's easily manipulated with one hand. If the strap of the belt fits through your belt loops, the buckle will fit as well. The belt itself measures one and a half inches in width, while the buckle maxes out at two inches. It also has a brand new adjustment mechanism that allows infinite adjustments and keeps the setting all day. The setting stays ready for next time even if you remove your belt. The belt features a dual flex technology that articulates in two dimensions. The buckle conforms to your waist and aligns with your natural contours. And of course, the Carbon Tactics Epoch is proudly made in the USA. So yeah, the Epoch by Carbon Tactics. Um, like I said, I've been wearing this thing for about two months now. And every day. I've worn it uh, just in casual wear. Um, I've worn it in the fire department as part of my uniform. I uh, use it as a battle belt and a duty belt working at the range. And this thing is just tough as nails. Uh, there's, uh, it's, it's virtually indestructible. I can't figure out a way to break it. Not that I want to. Um, it's very cool. If you're a firearms enthusiast, uh, one of the, the coolest features to me is the quick release mechanism itself. If you can, I don't know if that's going to show up, but that should look very familiar. It's actually like a mini AR trigger, and that's super satisfying. This, the little click, I love that. I don't know why, I just find it really satisfying. Um, let me see, there it is. So yeah, if you look at the release mechanism and an AR trigger, it's just a mini version of it. So it feels natural, especially if you're an AR shooter or a firearm enthusiast. You'll absolutely love this thing. Um, our good friend David Zaritsky at the Bond Experience kind of coined the phrase, you know, our invisible hobby. And this is an excellent way to put a little James Bond in your everyday carry or your everyday life. Another cool feature, um, they talk about this little articulation. It comes in really handy, especially if you're jogging or running, anything like that. This kind of contours with your body. It doesn't pinch, it doesn't poke or anything like that. It's super comfortable and very, very low profile. I absolutely love that. This thing is just tough as nails. It's not going anywhere. It's a fantastic belt. Um, the single strap nylon, uh, it's pretty standard. One thing that I absolutely 
can't say enough about um, is the compatibility. I have yet to find a pair of pants that this belt buckle will not fit through. Um, I mean, I've done jeans, khakis, BDUs, like tactical, je uh, tactical pants, and nothing. It fits everything. Unlike some other tactical buckles that I won't name, but there was a big craze about a year ago for one that was named after a snake. That thing was a pain in the ass. It's trash. Get yourself an epoch. Um, another thing I wanted to mention too, uh, when I had contacted them, uh, Carbon Tactics, without even asking, uh, they offered it to me. They just said, well, here's a promo code that you can give your viewers if you like the, if you like our product. And I do. So if you go to the Carbon Tactics website and you make a purchase, use promo code BONDARMORY and you'll get 10% off your entire purchase. That's very kind of them. Thank you, Carbon Tactics, very much for that. Um, other than that, yeah, I... Oh, that's another thing. If you're going to use this as, say, a battle belt or a duty belt, like I showed, there were three different options. I would probably go with either the double or the hybrid. Um, not that I think this is going to fail or anything like that, but if you're going to be carrying that much weight and everything, if you have multiple magazine pouches, um, maybe more than one firearm on one belt, knives, cuffs, things like that, um, yeah, I would probably want to double up or go with that hybrid system. The hybrid system just looks a lot nicer too. Um, not that there's anything wrong with this one. This is just, you know, your basic ballistic nylon style stuff. Um, it's great and yeah, I got nothing else. This is a fantastic product from Carbon Tactics and it gives you that little bit of bond in your everyday life. So I would order one. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe and I will see you next time on the Bond Armory.